Hey, what's up guys? So today we are in Sapporo, Japan and we are at the Sapporo Snow Festival in Hokkaido. This is like an annual festival that happens every February and this year it's from the 11th till, oh sorry, the 4th until the 11th. So this Sunday, which is today, until next Sunday. See here. So yeah, the festival they have lots of snow sculptures and ice sculptures and some really really big snow sculptures. So I figured we can do a quick walk around, uh, maybe about an hour or so today. Um, I have a lot of filming to do today, so. <laughs> We'll probably do this walk around live stream early in the morning right now and then later on in the day I'm going to do some 4K HDR filming and then I plan to do some same some more filming at nighttime because they do some illuminations and projection mappings on some of these. So hey guys, hey everybody, pilot girl, let's see, Michelle, Washoku, Fungus, Angry Yank. What's up everybody? Hawaiian, Tomoloko, Sven, Rauki, thanks guys, thanks for the 29 months pilot girl, hey Michelle, thanks for the 5 months, and Rauki, thanks for the 16 months. Okay, so these are the main snow sculptures, the smaller ones, I think they did a snow sculpture competition, so Let's take a walk around and see what kind of sculptures they got. I saw them, I was here this whole week and I saw uh, some of them while they were making them. But uh, I haven't actually seen all of them yet. So, one second guys. It's hard to touch things with my gloves. <laughs> okay, I got it. Okay. Hey, Angry Yank. Thank you so much for the tier 2. 12 months, man. Thank you so much. You finally made one year. Thanks, man. Okay, let's go. So I think these ones in the front here are the main ones that seem to be the most popular. Yeah, here's the poster. But yeah, here's the most popular ones, I think. This is the Shohei Otani, the baseball player. Yeah, I think when I film, I'm gonna have to bring the big selfie, the big uh, <laughs> monopod because there's just so many people, it's impossible to film normally. And of course, the Ghibli one is the most popular. I don't know what this one is. It's like a Godzilla with a kid inside. A gator? No, I think it's a Godzilla. Plan G. I don't know what that is. Oop. 
What's this? Futo. I don't know. Is the name on the sign? Yeah, the names are on the signs. Hmm, a fist? Hey, what's up, Warren? What's up, Emerson? <laughs> it's like a baseball dog. Any nugget shaped creatures, possibly? Yeah, there's so many foreign people here. It's amazing. I think I've heard more Chinese and Korean here than I have anywhere else in Japan. Whoa, look at this one. That's crazy. What is this one? It's just a blank lump. <laughs> what is this? Watashi no kimochi. What? It's just a big lump with a smiley face. <laughs> this they look like a basketball and a cat there's so many sculptures and it's freezing cold out here <laughs> what's the temperature there it should say at the bottom of the screen I think last I checked it was like negative something. <laughs> last night was negative four or negative seven or something. Hey look, tikis. Man, my hands are freezing. <laughs> Yeah, it's good that it's below freezing because then these all these snow sculptures are not going to melt. Biriken. <laughs> Ah, 
<laughs> I see you're negative four and raise you 28C we're getting here. Wow, I would love it to be 28 cent, uh, Celsius right now. Whoa, what is this? It's like a falcon parrot. Whoa. Cool. Dorekun. That's cool. Was it negative seven when you got here? Yeah, in some places. I went out to Otaru. It's like a smaller city just west of here, maybe about an hour. And yeah, at nighttime it was about negative seven. And snowing, it was freezing. It's a penguin. Pe penguin. It's truck coon. It always almost runs me over. <laughs> oh, what is this? Isn't this from some anime? What anime is this, guys? Jojo? Yeah, it does kind of look like Jojo. I don't know if it actually is though. Alright. Yeah, so at night time... Uh, I don't know if these are lit up, but there's definitely some illumination stuff around here. So yeah, I will definitely film at night time. Snow Festival is also in Yakuza 5? I didn't know that. I've never played any of the Yak Yakuza games. But it seems like they have a lot of real life places. Whoa, look at this thing. Yeah, it looks like worms in there. Whoa. <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> oh man, that's a scary face. What is this? <laughs> oh, who's this guy? This one's pretty cool. It's like somebody's boss.
Hey, I am Sana. Thank you so much. Okay, I think there's some stuff over here near the Sapporo Tower. Let's go check it out. I think this is more of a nighttime thing up here. Man, my hands are freezing. <laughs> the guy from up <laughs> it kind of did look like the guy from up oh look at this dog Hey, Bishop of Apples, thank you so much for the 15 months. Ooh, you're not late. Yeah, we started early today. What's this? I think this probably lights up at nighttime. Looks crazy. What is this? Sticks with lights. <laughs> I'm guessing this is some kind of like nighttime illumination thing. Huh. I guess you walk through those curtains and they're illuminated? I'm not sure. Hey Hawaiian, thanks for the five man, for the hot tea and drinks. Thank you so much. Oh, here we go. This is what it is. Last Snow, Sapporo International Art Festival. I guess this is like an art piece. Interesting. Oh, here comes the tour groups. Yeah, the tours are back in full force in Japan. It's a Korean tour group. Why are these pigeons just sitting here? What is going on? <laughs> They're so fat. <laughs> His neck is tucked into his body. <laughs> That's so weird. <laughs> hey, pilot girl, thank you for the five. Find or hot sake find, fund. Thank you. Yeah, the stores are not quite open yet, but. Uh, I think they'll open up here in maybe about an hour or so. It's still pretty early today. It's like not even 9 yet. I think this is the earliest I've ever streamed before. Oh look here, you can do ice luging. Or is that what it's called? Ice luging? Let's go see what they got at the base of uh, the tower. Hey, Hawaiian, thanks for the one gifted, man. Someone said the pigeons are fluffed up to get to keep warm. That's so funny. 
It's so funny that they're just sitting in the middle of the sidewalk and not bundled in a corner somewhere. Let's see what they got here. Yeah, I'm assuming it's gonna be super, super packed tonight. Oh, it's the souvenir goods shop. <laughs> Look at this snowman. This is my favorite one. Hey, Brian B, thanks for the two, man. This is for the fat pigeons. <laughs> and El Tomo Loco, thanks for the five. Watch out for yellow snow. <laughs> yes, for sure. I don't think there's gonna be anybody peeing out here, but hopefully, but we will see. There very, there very well may be some yellow snow at some point. Ooh, choco bananas. The typical Matsuri foods, churros. French fries, long French fries, like choco bananas. Oh, look at these. Too cute to eat, yeah, exactly. You're gonna bite their faces off. <laughs> okay, I'm tempted to walk through that heart, but I will resist the urge. What else do they have here? World wine. Tasting. <laughs> I guess you can do a wine tasting here. Interesting. Hopefully it'll be a nice day today. I wonder if the sun will come out. Am I doing the traditional long stream today? No, probably streaming for an hour, an hour and a half today. I'm probably going to prioritize uh, filming today. Oh. Little Russian dolls. Some of these look kind of scary. It's that Korean dude doing egg yo. <laughs> hey Toku, thanks for the one gifted man. Thank you. Oh yeah, and by the way, thanks to everybody who donated the past few months for this 
a snow trip fund. Definitely grateful. Oh shoot, we gotta make this light. Go, go. Yeah, I have a bunch of videos coming out from this trip, so thank you again, guys. And Getty Dirk, thanks for the 9.99. Cheers, VJ. Best wishes to you and your family. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. All right, we have yet to see the monster snow uh, sculpture, so let's go see the big ones. They're like three stories tall. Have you guys ever seen a three-story tall snow sculpture? <laughs> I was watch I've been watching them build them this week and uh, I should have took some video but I was busy with work. Uh, there's like they're building it at nighttime and they have all these army guys up on scaffolding doing all the sculpting and stuff. Ah, I regret not filming that but uh, you guys will get to see the end result anyway. Could have been like a making of the snow festival. Maybe I'll keep that in mind for next year. One of the videos of BJ eating king crab. I haven't eaten crab while I was up here, actually. I had basically all the other Sapporo foods. Like uh, some of them are Genghis Khan. It's like a lamb yakiniku. Uh, what else do they have? Miso ramen is the type of ramen that's popular here. Well, I'm sure all ramens are popular, but that's like their staple. Sapporo miso ramen. They put like a butter and corn in there. And yeah, I went ice fishing. You can see it on my Instagram. I posted some of the videos. What else? I had some uni. I usually don't like uni or sea urchin, but the uni they have in Hokkaido is so good. Usually uni has like a brownish color sometimes and it's a little bitter at the in aftertaste. And sometimes if you get a bad one, it's like kind of grainy, but the ones in Hokkaido are just so good. It's like creamy, like avocado. It's nice and sweet. No weird aftertaste. Man, it's so good. But it's just weird to know that when you eat uni, it's uh, you're eating the gonads of the the <laughs> of the animal. So there's that. Was the ice fishing for real? Yeah, it was for real. Check on my Instagram story. You can see uh, me ice fishing. They dug little holes in the ice, and. Uh, you, you get a little tiny fishing rod, like a kid's fishing rod, and uh, you can catch little tiny fish. And then they tempura fry them for you right there. Hey, Matt Frazier, welcome to the community. All right. Hey, we missed this diglet. Diglet encounters a silver world. Why don't they have these English captions on all of them? They know they're going to have so many foreign tourists. <laughs> all right. Penguin and snake? Penguin and dolphin? Warren said vegetarian friendly ramen. I don't know if it's actually vegetarian friendly. I'm pretty sure the broth is has some kind of pork in it, but I'm not really sure. <laughs> Snorlax. Oh no, the crowds are filling in. Oh man. I am dreading thinking about filming later today and tonight. It's gonna to be so packed. 
like shoulder to shoulder in here. So I'm glad I'm doing this early today. Yeah, just being out in the streets, it's been super, super packed in Sapporo. Like, uh, going to dinner, I think one night, Friday night, I went to maybe, uh, you know, somewhere between 7 and 10 restaurants, and they, I got turned away from all of them because it was full. There's just that many people here. So, I'm pretty sure once the stores open, and uh, it's around maybe noon time. This place is gonna be crazy packed. Hey, Hawaiian! Thanks for the 41 months, man. That's tier one. Thank you, dude. Okay, let's go check out the big, the big snow sculptures. What is this? A smoking lounge? This is a big smoking lounge. Can you guys see that sculpture there in the background? I think that's from Jojo, right? I could be wrong. I don't watch very much anime. Oh look, the foods have started and the lines are already getting long. Alright, let's not miss, there's some things over here. So before we go to the big, big one, let's check out some stuff on the way. What is this? Blue Archive. I don't know what that is. Must be popular. <laughs> Look at all the foods. They even have the wonderful fish sperm soup. <laughs> it's a shirako soup. It is actually fish sperms. <laughs> I've had it before, but I've never had it in soup. Rayama Kanata, arigatou gozaimasu. Oh, look at all the steam. It's a butter potatoes. That song is like giving seizures. It is very hyperactive. What is this? Snows. Limited winter edition. I guess they're waiting for limited edition cookies. What is this? Whoa. Opens at nine. Yeah, it's crazy. It's not even open yet and it's getting packed. I think it starts at 10. Smoking lounge is just for people who smoke, or is it something else? Yeah, I notice a lot of people here smoke tobacco still. Um, it's for like smoking. It's uh, the company Glow. I think they sell.
Yes, I will check that out later. Looks like a shonen anime, probably. Look how big it is. They had to like bring in some building scaffolding just to shape it at night time. <laughs> yeah, they had the like bulldozers and like mini cranes just to make this thing. And there's another big one up here. Oh, it's so packed already. <laughs> Let's see, I've been to the snow festival a couple times already and I think this is like the the DJ booth. <laughs> it's kinda cool. It's like a snow snow DJ booth. Golden Kamui is the Russian invasion of Japan. Oh, I didn't know that. That sounds interesting. All right, I, you guys got me hooked. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check it out. Or you got me interested. <laughs> DJ VJ, let's go. Hey, Fungus, thank you so much, man. Thanks for the 20. What did you say here? Greetings from Tokyo. Flew in yesterday. Enjoy your time in Hokkaido. Oh, awesome. Hope you're having a good time in Tokyo. You know, it's been a long time for you. Wanting to come again. Look at this thing. It's like an obelisk. Okay, anyway. This is... It's a ho horse racing. Yeah, horse racing is really big in Japan. It's like uh, for gambling. So they have a lot of money to spend. <laughs> but they have a projection mapping on this at nighttime. I saw them testing it the other day. I'll definitely film that one tonight. Okay, let's go look at the schedule. Whoa, look at these huge dogs. These dogs are so big. Let's see, so the projection mapping is from 5.30 p.m. to 9.45 and they look like this. Whoa, it's big. That dog is huge. It's taller than me. Okay, let's go check out the other side. I don't think I've been past the, here yet. There's a whole other section of the park.
Yeah, it's crazy how much money these uh, horse racing places have. Like, you know, if you guys know the winter illumination video as I posted, every year I post the mega illuminations. That's actually at a horse track in Tokyo. So, yep, horse racing and horse race gambling is really big in Japan. It's, uh, remember we went uh, also to the velodrome and there's like all those old dudes gambling and hanging out? That's what it was. Someone said those dogs are Afghan hounds. Yeah, those dogs were huge. Oh, here, if you're in Hokkaido and you see one of these bins, it's actually like a sand and salt. You can put it on the road to break up the ice. This is sand for the ice. Please use it freely. I guess if you're bored, you can come and sand the sidewalks to get rid of the ice if you're just super bored. <laughs> or I guess if it's in front of your business or your home. Oh my god, I'm gonna get trampled. Let's see, do they have more sculptures over here? Oh, they have a few. Oh, they do have a couple of big ones down there at the end. I haven't seen those yet. Yeah, see these guys in these uniforms? These guys are out all night making those large sculptures. Ooh, what's this? Sapporo Convention Center, 20th anniversary. Let's see, oh, these are more abstract. Not like characters or anything, just like abstract shapes. I guess this, this is like for some kind of art museum. Oh, here's those dogs again. Huge dogs. Whoa. Oh look, it's Yu-Gi-Oh! Wow, I haven't thought about Yu-Gi-Oh! in a long time. Twenty-five years of Yu-Gi-Oh! Wow. Is that the blue eyes white dragon? Small horse. Yeah, exactly, right? It, like, I bet a kid could comfortably ride that. <laughs> Alright, let's see. What do they got over here? Whoa, ReZero. Third season. I didn't know that ReZero had a third season. I thought that sh that anime was over. All right, I'm excited to see what's over here.
Will I go to the snow festival in Ashikawa? Uh, no, I don't really have any plans for that right now. Alright, let's go. Cool. Now I'm gonna put that on my list of other anime. I don't really watch a lot of anime anymore, but... I'm definitely gonna check out that Golden Gamui and ReZero Season 3. I saw the first one, and I think I saw the second one. Oh, Ram and Ram. Cool. Very nice, very nice. What is this? I don't know this anime. Does anyone know this anime? Dungeon. Dungeon. Some dungeon anime? Dungeon Meshi. Delicious dungeon anime. Ooh, Godzilla, where's Toku? Whoa. Look at his face. Look at his teeth. Whoa, there's a lot more over here than I was expecting. Is this Jujutsu Kaisen? I've never seen this either. Ooh, Haikyuu! I know this one. What's this one? 
some cat anime. Let's see, what is this one? Driving school? Dr there's a driving school anime? <laughs> what? That's interesting. Dogs. Hey, that dog has three legs. Whoa, Gundam. What's this? The opening ceremony? Oh, they're gonna do a ri ribbon cutting. I almost tripped and fell down. <laughs> Alright, let's watch them cut the ribbon. I don't know what it's for though. それでは皆様、リボンの左側のテープを持ちまして、右側のテープにハサミを入れる準備をしてお待ちください。ご準備はよろしいでしょうか。私がどうぞと申しましたら、テープにハサミを入れください。会場の皆様は、見事テープにハ
More ceremonies. Holy crap. I didn't even see that they were building this one over here. This is massive also. Hey, I want to take a video of the snow sculpture. <laughs> they have a whole snow house. Crazy. Look how big it is. It's like almost the size of a normal house. What is this? I guess they're just rehearsing for something? Alright, well, let's move on. Oh, look, they have the military band. Japan Ground Self Deforce. Self Defense Force. Cool. Snow Beauty Pageant. Oh, here you go. That building is the old Sapporo train station. Amazing. Huh. I guess the festivities don't start till 10 something. Whoa, even the sides have the decorations. Crazy. more dog baseball dog <laughs> <laughs> oh, this one's cool. It's kind of like Godzilla, but not. He's holding like a mochi donut, and instead of the scales on his back, it's like little stairs. <laughs> There's more over here. All right, let's go to the end and we'll walk back this way. Nasuba-chan. I have no idea who that is. It's 
Is this also that uh, golden kamui? Maybe because it has to do with uh, Russia and Japan and Hokkaido so close to Russia. Maybe it's like very popular here. Hey, Angry Yank. Thanks for the one gifted, man. Thank you. Bro, that guy's on double duty. He's got a GoPro necklace and he's doing his phone gimbal walk. Crazy. Hey, it's Mario. Mario. Mario looks a little dirty though. <laughs> Why does he have dirty snow? Oh, and here's a more artistic version of uh, Otani. <laughs> Definitely different than the other one we saw. But this one's cool too. I wonder if this is like the community made section. These look more homey. <laughs> He came from a dirty pipe, Dirty Mario. That's true. Maybe it is more realistic. He is a plumber. Ooh, he's coming out of onsen. Definitely know that feeling. Look at its face. It's like, ah, onsen. Yeah, the hotel I'm staying in has like an onsen inside the building. It's been definitely nice. Don't think I would have survived without it. Oh look guys, it's Pikachu! <laughs> and a weird Bulbasaur and Squirtle. <laughs> Wait, where's Charmander? He got left out. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, Doraemon. Look at Nobita's face. <laughs> That's awesome. Damn, this one's cool. Look at his face, he got trampled. <laughs> Look at that eye mole. <laughs> awesome. Looks like big VJ. Oh my god. Looks like a weird twisted Charlie Brown. I mean, it is kind of at the same level. Is that true? Is Doraemon to Japan what Charlie Brown is to the Un United States? Yo, look at this one. He's hiding over there. <laughs> A broken little snowman. <laughs> Whoa. Snow Ninja. <laughs> it's the, the snowman that got left behind. <laughs> There's more? All right, let's finish up over here. Chainsaw Man. Chita. Wait, is this Psyduck? It's Psyduck. <laughs> what the heck? Awesome. What is this? Whoa, there's even more. What? I didn't even walk this far this whole week. Alright, let's see what they got over here. Sake tasting area. Oh, what is everybody lined up for? Yeah, instead of a cup noodle, it's like an instant rice dish. Oh, what are they lined up for? Oh, it's a snow tubing. Cool. Kanzen Miru. I guess you can slide down this little hill they made. That's cool. I guess it's gonna start at 10 maybe.
perfect meal, yes. <laughs> Short stream today, six hours later. No, not today. Like, there's a lot more here than I expected, but not six hours worth. I gotta check out of my hotel today I, at 11, so... Definitely gotta finish up before then. Whoa, what is this? It's the Nippon Fighters, Ham Fighters, Nippon Ham Fighters. Whoa. I think this is the last one. I think this is the uh, the Winter Olympics Memorial or whatever it is. I think they had the Olympics here. I forget what year it was. The Winter Olympics and then they forever have this uh, Winter Olympics uh, monument or whatever you want to call it. Twenty twenty four International Snow Sculpture Contest. Oh. Oh, okay. They're still making them. Gotcha. Yeah, this is the one that uh, I think it starts from yesterday, and then they're gonna have a competition with these uh, different international teams. So they started yesterday, and then they'll be building until uh, the sixth. And then I guess they have the ceremony awards at on the 7th. So there's Korea, Daejeon, Hawaii, USA. Hey, Hawaii's here. And Indonesia, Lithuania, Mongolia, Poland, USA, Portland, Singapore, and Thailand. Cool. Jamaica? No, no bobsled team here today. Sorry. Oh, here's Team Hawaii, and this is the Olympics thing. What are they making? Oh, it's fish and manta rays. Cool. Very nice. See, so this is what it looks like when they're just still building them. Oh cool, so they draw on it to show the design. Whoa, they actually have a stone sculpture of what they're gonna make. What? Thank you. 
Let's see. Lithuania. Indonesia. That looks pretty ambitious. Interesting. Poland. Let's see, who's this one? Portland? That's interesting that some of them have their sculptures pre-made, like the design, others don't. Cool. Let's see, Singapore. Looks like Singapore is off to a slow start. <laughs> That's cool though, they just start off with a huge block of ice. And this is Daejeon, Korea. In the Sepporu Snow Festival, the International Snow Sculpture Contest is now being held at Odori Park, West 11, International Square. Nine teams joined the contest this year. Beijing Metropolitan City of South Korea, Hawaii of USA, Indonesia, <laughs> Can you guys hear that weird English? <laughs> All right, I think we finished. We are approaching the end here, but there's still the ice sculptures, not the snow sculptures, but there's also an ice sculpture section that I wanted to take you to. So I think we have enough time for that. I have maybe about 30 more minutes. So yeah, let's go look at the ice sculptures after this. Oh, and of course, no snow festival would be complete without Snow Miku. <laughs> I remember this from the first time I came. And hello kitty. <laughs> and I think that's it. Yeah, there's just like a, I don't know, a garden down here. But I think that's the end of the snow sculptures. So let's walk back and we can go check out the ice sculptures. Uh, I guess that's one of the benefits of coming to the snow festival for the second weekend is that you get to see the the international contest sculptures finished but I guess it's cool to see them in progress
Whoa. He's sawing the ice, sawing the snow. That's cool. All right, let's walk back and go see the, the ice sculptures. Let's see, let's go this way. Yeah, honestly, before I started this stream, I was thinking, man, is there gonna be enough things to see for an hour stream? But <laughs> as always, I grossly underestimate how long things take for the stream. So much snow. Yeah, look how high this mound is. Look how tall this wall is, guys. I'm a little scared. It's like tilting backwards. It kind of looks like it's gonna fall. That's pretty scary. Look at it. It's tilted back. How is, how is that okay? Looks like it's about to fall over. It's pretty scary. Alright, let's go. <laughs> They're starting the tube slides. Alright, let's go watch them slide down the, the snow hill. <laughs> Miller, Miller says, we know you underestimate. That's why we love you. Uh, thanks, guys. <laughs> oh, there they go. They're going up the, the stairs. All right, let's go watch them slide down. Wow, they even have a, a person that's a line counter that says uh, how long it takes to wait for this. I guess it's 20 minutes right now. I guess it's uh, only for kids. I don't think we can go down this slide, guys. Here they go. First slide of the year. Oh wait, there's an adult on there. What?
<laughs> That's cool. Ooh, Hokkaido sake shot and bottle sales store. Very cool. Maybe I'll come back here later today. Oh nice, I guess once the festival starts they actually close the road. That's nice. With all these people, I'm glad that they're closing the road. <laughs> Some people said that's worth 20 minutes. Yeah, I think so. If I was a kid or if I had my kid here, I would definitely wait 20 minutes for that. Hey, we missed these. Elephants. Hey, it's Ultraman. Is Toku here? Wait, what is this? <laughs> oh, we missed these. Here's a lamb. What's this? Some anime. There's a toilet over there. And the chest pieces. <laughs> Look at how the snow is dumped on top of this vending machine. It's so fat. It's like a fourth of the size of the actual vending machine. Okay, let's head over to ice sculptures. Someone said they're making an Ultraman movie in the States. Awesome. Oh, the band is here. Oh, what is everybody waiting for? Whoa. This is a big crowd. What is this? Uh, just the opening ceremony again. I think we can skip that. The ribbon cutting was a little underwhelming. I guess this one's a little cooler because they have the band here. They're waiting for me. Yeah, totally, guys. Oh, look at all these people. Hello, everyone. 
2024札幌雪まつりにお越しの皆様本日は大通り会場8丁目雪の HTB 広場にお集まりいただきまして誠にありがとうございますまもなく10時15分よりここ大雪像旧札幌停車場ステージにおきまして2024札幌雪まつりの開会式を行います All right, I wanna stay, but... I have to check out of my hotel at 11, so we need to make it to the ice sculptures, which is more important. <laughs> Sorry, guys. You can see the, the Japan ban another time. Alright, l let's go to the ice sculptures. I think they also closed off some other areas around town, but. Oh, here, they even have a live action of that golden kamui. It's that popular? I've never seen it before. Alright, let's go look at it over there. Alright, I'm intrigued now about this, this anime and live action movie. Now on my my number one on my list of things to watch, Golden Kamui. Golden Kamui is really popular. I had no idea, guys, but I'm glad that we discovered it during this stream. Someone said live action is usually not that great. Maybe I'll watch the live action first so I'm not disappointed. And then after I watch the live action, I can watch the anime and be wowed. <laughs> How does that sound, guys? Oh, yeah, here's the castle where they had the ribbon cutting. Must look great when it's lit up at night. I'll take a video of that later tonight. Also, need to watch Dungeons and Dragons. I watched that one, it was better than I was expecting. There's a few more here that I missed. Who's this? Who's that? <laughs> Cat and dolphin? Whoa, this one looks scary. Overlord. What is this one? Looks cool. Golden Kamui has 49 episodes. Oh wow. Very nice, very nice. Yeah, that Overlord one was pretty awesome. I'm trying to figure out where where was the the way to Susukino.
I think it's this next street, right? Yeah, the ice sculptures are a little further away from here. It's um, nearby Susukino Station, which is the main shopping and entertainment district. I guess more entertainment, like restaurants, bars, more than shopping. Shopping is more between Sapporo Station and Susukino. here. No, not this street. Maybe the next street. Oh, another opening ceremony. Uh, they're just giving an overview of when they're going to do the projection mapping on the horse racing one. They said from 5.30 they'll have their projection mapping. Hey, we totally missed this one. What is this? Why is it another one bites the dust playing? <laughs> what is this? Oh, it's Queen. What? I guess that answers the question. Anti-streamer technique. Yeah, I'll probably have to go back and mute that later. So that's the benefit of watching live, is you guys can watch with all the original sounds. Wait, hold on. Look at his eyebrows. The, it even has crazy eyebrows. What the heck? That's crazy, the amount of detail they put into that one. Whoa, snow's getting all mushy. Hey, I missed this one. It's a Tamagotchi. What? <laughs> Oh, I didn't know Tamagotchi was still a thing.
Yeah, for anyone just tuning in, we're in Hokkaido in Sapporo for the Sapporo Snow Festival. Whoa, look at all these people. This is way more busy than before. Okay, let's go to the ice sculptures. It's maybe like a five minute walk. Yeah, there's so many people now, and it's gonna get even crazier. No wonder they have their riot bus here. Don't slip. Yeah, thank you. I'll ch I won't. Thankfully, I haven't slipped yet this trip, so at least not badly. How much are the hotels? Uh, I think the hotel that I got was uh, pretty reasonable. I think it was around 8,000 yen per night. So that's maybe, what, like 50 US dollars a night? And it has a onsen inside. It's not a bad deal, right? It's a pretty good deal. Some of y'all might want to hit the like button. Yeah, yeah guys, thank you. If you could hit the like button, definitely would appreciate that. And subscribe if you guys like Japan content or 4K HDR content. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. In, uh, in Sapporo, they have this like light rail that goes around this, the, this part of the city. Maybe we'll catch a glance of the light rail going around. Oh, there it is. It's just leaving. You can see it over there. The green car. Alright, let's make this light. Oh, here comes another one. Uh, light rail. They also have a subway, but I think these little cars are cool. I guess it's definitely better than a bus because, you know, it's always going to be snowy here in the winter time, so I guess it's safer to be on tracks. Trams? Yeah, trams, light rail. I'm not sure what's the difference, but yes, it's that. Whew. Yeah, I was surprised to find that there are a lot more malls in Sapporo than I remember. A lot of like new malls. It's really really nice. I don't remember Sapporo being like this luxury and shopping and all these kind of nice modern places. They really uh, are redoing the whole place. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, so if you guys have visited Japan before and you did the Tokyo, Osaka, Kyoto already, 
I would definitely recommend coming to Sapporo because it's a lot better than I expected. I've been here for maybe about a week now and uh, yeah, it's definitely fun. Even though it's a little smaller than uh, Osaka or yeah, I think it feels bigger than Kyoto. There's definitely more things to do. And they have these uh, long shopping streets like this. And it goes all the way the other, other way too. That's like the older Sapporo that I remember from my first time here. But yeah, all the new malls are definitely a different experience. Hey Taylor, thank you for so much for the five. Hey mate, thank you for showing the snow. I really, I enjoy nature around the world and it's always great to learn culture chalks. Much respect. Thank you so much Taylor. Uh, culture shocks. Yeah, so see this building here? This is the JRA building. That's like the horse gambling, horse race gambling company. Horse race gambling is a big business in Japan. Puka Hare, thanks for the two dollars. Ice sculptures are scattered around the city. Yeah, well I think the main one is over here. It says Ice World, so we're gonna go there now. Hey Yogi Mew. Yeah, I think when I go filming later today or, and tonight, I'll try to look up where the other ice sculptures are so I can get them all in. But thanks for letting me know. I probably get, we'll get a, a map of the place. I think they're handing out maps back there. But yeah, what I thought was going to be a one to one and a half hour stream turned out to be a two to two and a half hour stream. <laughs> Yeah, this mall here, this Kokono Susukino, this mall is brand new. This wasn't here when I was here last time. It's huge. And this is the classic Susukino view of the Nikko whiskey sign and the Sapporo beer sign. And Asahi. Hey, Puka Hare. Thanks for the five. Malls are okay, but love locally owned places, especially restaurants. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, running a little bit low on time here, guys. So, pardon the, the rushing through it. We'll probably just walk through the ice sculptures and then I'll probably end the stream after that, but don't worry, I will definitely record them in their full glory in 4K HDR later today. I think they'll close the street later tonight, but for now it's still open. Look at it. Look at that big block of snow. Our big block of ice. That's the Sapporo clock tower, all made of ice.
look at them. The ice looks so clean. Whoa, look at this one. That's crazy. Hey, Puka, welcome to the community. Whoa, look at that fish. I'm surprised they haven't closed down this part of the streets. I thought it was closed the last time I came, but maybe that's only at night time? Boat race. Oh yeah, boat racing, boat race gambling is also very uh, lucrative here in Japan. <laughs> Definitely a big thing. Oh yeah, we went. We went to the boat race place before, remember? Those guys sliding around in those little one-man boats. Yeah, I almost forgot about that. All right, I think this is almost the end here. Let's cross here where everybody else is. Oh, this is the, from the Ainu people. I knew is the original ethnic group that lived in Hokkaido before before the now Japanese people uh, kicked them out. <laughs> so, yep, they're still here and they have their own museum. I haven't been, but I definitely want to check it out. Oh, well, I guess this is the end of them. Yep, these look pretty mid. <laughs> Alright, let's take a walk back on the other side. And then uh, I will wrap up the stream back in the Susukino intersection. Because I gotta go check out of my hotel and uh, meet up with a friend for lunch. And then I gotta. I have a lot of filming to do after that. So please don't worry. We, I will definitely capture it all for you guys. Uh, in 4K HDR today. Yeah, you know for the boat race, I heard that anybody can try out and uh, try to become a boat racer. I kind of want to try it. kind of want to try and become a boat racer. What do you guys think? Another live stream? No, not tonight. <laughs> VJ walking back to his hotel like a horse racer. <laughs> yeah, maybe if they have like a, a boat racing thing you can try for fun. I would definitely want to try. Looks really cool.
Whoa, look at this one. All right, one more zoom in. And then we gotta go. Holy crap, that is so detailed. All right, let's go. Yeah, this is like a, like the adult entertainment district. Hey look, it's Don Quixote. Whoa, and one with lives, not live, but actual seafood in it. All right, this deserves its own, one more zoom in. Oh, it's Sushi Zanmai, the sushi train restaurant. All right, 10.30, I think I should be able to make it. I still have to pack up a little bit, but uh, should be good on time. This is the brand new mall here. I've been in and I looked at some of the floors. Some, one of the floors isn't open yet, but uh, it's pretty nice in there. I'll just cross the street and then uh, we'll wrap it up over here. with the view of the famous Nika Whiskey Man. All right, thank you guys so much for joining me for the Sapporo Snow Festival this year. I'm gonna go to my hotel and check out and do a bunch of filming today. I'm gonna probably do one daytime version and one nighttime version of all the same stuff we saw today, but in 4K HDR. So thank you guys again so much. Uh, for sponsoring this snow trip. It's been a wonderful trip. If you guys want to see w what I've been doing on the trip besides filming, please check out my Instagram. Um, if someone can post a link to that, please. And uh, yeah, hope you guys have a great weekend and I will see you guys next time. Ooh. All right, thank you guys. I'll see you later. Bye guys. Just keep painting constantly